But it is also good to know that everything that we start with God, if you walk with God, He will, faithful, he will be faithful to you and will help you to get to the end. So at the end, you can say, Lord, we finished or we accomplished our mission. We remember when we came to Immaculate Church and there we bow before you. It's an invitation to see that it is God who gives you, a, who gives you the life and keeps your life and, and, and keeps you the truth together. So it is the beating of the heart of one to be loved. Then the two of you are going to walk with love, with the love of God. Hi, Robert. Thank, Thank you, Robert, Vanessa, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bed and in sickness and in health, to love you, to honor you all the days of my life. I was also there the night Bobby and Vanessa met. I don't know if you guys had a chance to look at the uh, website, but I don't want to get too into detail, but I was there. Um, and for anyone who says first love, love at first sight doesn't exist, I'm gonna have to beg to differ because I saw the way these two looked at each other and I just knew immediately that there was a connection that was just not going away anytime soon. Um, over the last seven years, I've also witnessed them do life together. The more I witnessed, the more I realized that they were best friends and perfect for each other. Like I said earlier, I consider myself Bobby's brother and we have been through, been through some really tough times together. Seeing how happy Bobby is around Vanessa, talking about Vanessa, really anything Vanessa. <laughs> I wouldn't say this if I mean it, but you're the, you're, the, you're the best thing that ever happened to him. So I'm happy that you guys met because you guys are like my brother and sister, so. Um, and V from Bob, you're gonna get a really loyal husband sincere and he's probably one of the most generous people I've ever met and he would honestly do anything for you. I think anybody over there also knows, probably anybody in here knows how Bob is and he will give you the shirt off his back so cherish that. So she clearly jumped on the comedy train. There's one video of her holding me when I was a baby, and she asked my mom if she could drop me on the floor. <laughs> Obviously, she loved having a little sister. Tagging along to her first concert with her friends, Andrea, Taste of Chaos. <laughs> Stealing her clothes, you know, little sister stuff. But the truth is, I've always looked up to my sister. She's an intelligent and such a hard worker. She pushes me to, to not be scared and to move forward in my career. And she's also my number one supporter. Bobby, you're locking down one of the best ones. Thank you.